It was a peculiar night when I found myself on an express train. Hurtling through the darkness with an unsettling destination ahead. The clock struck 12 midnight. And as the train rumbled on, a man boarded at a seemingly deserted halfway station. His arrival was shrouded in an eerie quiet. As if the very air held its breath in anticipation. As the door closed behind him, the man's eyes darted around the carriage, scrutinizing the faces of the passengers with an intensity that suggested a sudden awakening from a deep slumber. In the dim light, his gaze landed on me, and he approached with an inexplicable certainty. Forgive me for being foolish, are you 28 years old? His question hung in the air. A cryptic echo that sent shivers down my spine. Yes, but how do you know? I inquired. My curiosity mingling with a growing sense of unease. Ignoring my question. He proceeded to engage with others in the carriage. Seemingly unfamiliar to him. Yet his queries were anything but ordinary. You're 45 years old, aren't you? He asked one passenger who confirmed with a nod. Are you 62 years old? He questioned another, receiving a bewildered acknowledgement in response. Repeating these eerie conversations, the man unveiled an otherworldly ability to discern the age of passengers with nothing more than a glance. The atmosphere in the train shifted, and the passengers, including myself, couldn't help but watch the unfolding spectacle with a mix of curiosity and trepidation. As the train hurtled towards the next stop, approximately 15 minutes away, the man continued his unsettling interactions. The air in the carriage seemed charged with an unspoken tension, and the passengers couldn't look away from the peculiar stranger. The man's attention eventually turned to a lady seated towards the end of the carriage. Are you 50? He inquired, his eyes piercing into her very soul. Yes, but I'll be 51 years old in five minutes. The lady replied with a smile, unaware of the strange web of fate tightening around her. Suddenly, the man's face contorted. The color draining from his features as if he had witnessed something beyond the realms of human comprehension. A palpable silence ascended upon the carriage. Broken only by the rhythmic thud of the train hurtling towards its unknown destination. The man recoiled, staggering backward as though struck by an unseen force. His eyes widened in horror, as if he had glimpsed the unyielding grip of an unfathomable force. The passengers exchanged uneasy glances, sensing that something far more sinister than mere age identification was at play. In that haunting moment, the man mumbled incomprehensible words, as if wrestling with a revelation too ghastly to articulate. The air thickened with an oppressive energy, and a chilling wind seemed to sweep through the carriage carrying with it the whispers of an ageless entity that defied the laws of mortality. The train hurtled towards the next stop. Yet the atmosphere inside had shifted into an otherworldly realm. The man, now visibly shaken, clutched at his chest as if struggling against an unseen force. Passengers exchanged concerned glances their curiosity evolving into an unsettling awareness of the supernatural unfolding before them. As the train screeched to a halt at the next station, the man stumbled off, his haunted gaze lingering on the passengers, with a depth of terror that transcended the mere acknowledgement of age. The doors closed, sealing his enigmatic presence in the eerie darkness of the night. Left in the wake of this inexplicable encounter, the passengers shared hushed whispers, attempting to grasp the reality of the unearthly events that had transpired. The air in the carriage remained charged, resonating with the weight of a revelation too profound to only really comprehend. The train continued its journey through the night, leaving behind the haunted carriage with its perplexed passengers. In the aftermath, the memory of the man who could discern ages lingered like a ghostly imprint. 
a testament to the unsettling mysteries that entwined themselves with the fabric of reality. The express train, now an unwitting vessel for the supernatural, carried its passengers into the unknown. Forever bound by the haunting encounter with the enigmatic force that transcended the boundaries of time and age. What would you do if you were in this situation?